All right, let's do this brand new Let's Play. New game. Let's play Duke Nukem. Let's get this thing started. Starting the game. So you are the pitiful hero they sent to stop me. I, Doctor Proton, will soon rule the world. You're wrong, Proton, bruh. I'll be done with you and still have time to watch Oprah. So this is Duke Nukem One, the beginning of that amazing video game series that we all know and love. Started out with this game right here, Duke Nukem One. It's a side-scroll shooter. Basically, the point of the game is walk around, shoot things. Hence the side-scroll shooter. As you'll probably notice playing through this game, or watching you play through this game, it pretty much has nothing to do whatsoever with what the games later become, the Duke Nukem 3D series. Um, best my knowledge, there are no strippers in the game. There's no alcohol, no drug references, none of that stuff. Um, it's really just this guy with a Laser gun, I suppose. I guess that's what you call it. It's basically going around for mass shooting video cameras. He really likes to do that. Um, let's stick it to the man, I suppose. Can't watch the big. Can't have big brother watching you. You stick, man. Ah, that's not it. Yeah. This is my second attempt doing this, so that's why I'm playing it too. I play this a lot as a kid, actually. Had it on the computer when I used to be really young. And got into this thing. So I was actually really excited when I saw that there was actually Duke Nukem 3D. And I mean, Duke Nukem 3D was alright, but it really does not compare to this at all. Look at this. This is maybe one of the best things I've ever made. It's part Mario, part Metroid, as you'll later see when I start getting things into the inventory. That is all awesome. Okay, yeah, but you will notice that Duke Nukem actually does look a lot like he, you know, he is not 3D games, so. It's not like we just took a random character and just decided. Let's just continue on with this now. All oh, these guys. Crap. Mm, this is also going to be the first Let's Play I'm actually going to play through an entire game. Some more of you than the other things I did. The paid weren't really games, but screw those people. There's a, there's a secret wall. Did you remember that? In fact, this is an elevator. That's some real elevator action for you. What the gay crap that people are trying to pull off this elevator action nowadays. I'm not naming any names, but oh, come on. Yeah. Let's see how this part. This is actually just for bonus points here. I don't know why I didn't want that. Let's get out of here. Get towards the exit of this level so we don't need to see two levels for this segment of Let's Play. I guess it is actually going to be the first thing I planned actually. Go through and Beat it. I never actually beat it when I was kicked. I had to share a version which actually cut off. I believe this is the full version, but I can't be sure. I guess we're gonna have to find out and see. If there's the share a version, then you know, we'll see enough of the game. Which guys don't know what it's all about. Yeah, there's TNT. It does hurt you. Lightning does hurt you in this game. Um. That's a pro tip for me. Don't get any lightning. These things are weird generators. You die immediately if you jump into them. So just don't jump into them. 
Wow, I don't even keep my uh, keys on that. All my points. Wow, I was gonna show you guys an example of something again. Competing tips again, too. Uh, I guess we're probably like a really easy to the key is. Just be it really quick. Get to that next level. Swear to God, guys, there's a next level. Can you get displays the tips again? That's bizarre. Shoot this bunch of times. Boom! Die! Get out of here! Notes. You want to join the next level? Now is a good time to save your game. Which I am going to do. Save the one. Save the ball. This last play that I scrapped, I did not even get to the second level. This is the first time I've played this level in probably about seven or eight years. So. I want that disc. It's fine to do making discs because that's what all these players are doing. It's a good one. Oh, yeah, a blue king. I'll give that blue ball. But yeah, this game has nothing, nothing to do with the Duke Nukem 3D franchise, where that franchise eventually went. Um, don't know why they stopped having Dr. Photon, or Proton, or whatever his name is. Pretty cool. A lot cooler than Alien Warthogs, or Alien Pig, or whatever they ended up going with. I did like the stripper thing. I would like to see some... Uh, Animated strippers. Um, I'm at eight minutes now. I probably can't get to another level, so that'll be it for part one of Let's Play Duke Nukem. This is Vanilla Mummy signing out. Good night and good luck.